Hi guys, welcome to this um, virtual machine. I've just installed Qtile with the ISO of November. And there was a question on Discord. And what do you do then? You go to Control Alt F or G or V. So these are all key bindings. And you go to YouTube. Or you go to our websites, right? One of those. And you find your information about Qtile. Now, I just went to YouTube on our channel, not YouTube as such, but to our channel and look for a theming for Qtile. So here is all the information that you need. Anything you that user has asked in the past, it's all on there already. So this is your university. This is your study. This is what you need to see and watch and so on. Now on YouTube, <coughs> you can do the search here as well. It's going to be a little bit different. It's important to know that YouTube contains a few, like a trillion of videos, right? First, you need to get to the Eric Dubois Arcanlex channel. That's one thing. If you're not there, no results, because this is not the way to search. This is the way to search. So here you type in Qtile and teaming, rising, cursors, keyboard, whatever word you think might give a proper result and this is of course out of our reach i mean the search engine of youtube is not under our uh, government or, or we have no say over it right so i typed in qtile theme or theming and stuff like that and i found these things how to create a new theme and so on i was on garuda i wasn't on devos because at some point in time we told you guys, doesn't matter if you start with Arcanlex or Archlinx or Endeavor OS, because in the end, it's all Arch. And the difference is the choice that people made. Endeavor OS chooses this, Garuda chooses that, and Arcanlex chooses this, and that's it. It's a choice all the time. How to theme Tiny Window Manager's icons, done on left WM, Qtile, change the menu, and so on. So this is your search. This is where you start. If you do not find your answer here, then you come to us, right? University of Self-Study. And the theming, and the question here was the theming. So up here is a bar. Well, first of all, I see something red. So the reflex is I've done an easy installation, meaning there was no update since the build of the ISO. So that's the first thing you do. And for me, it's a good test to see everything works. So this is an image we took at some point in time, November, month, uh, six weeks, seven weeks, seven weeks ago, probably seven or eight. And the packages have been changed on all the Arch Linux servers, not only Arch, but Arch stuff as well. You see here, everything with Arco, that's us, and all the rest is Arch. So 90%, if not more, is here pure Arch. People will discuss about it, but no, it is it is what you see. It's pure Arch Linux packages. And all that's Arch Linux is from us, so let's say three, four percent in this particular Qtile ISO. And then some of the packages are not from Arch, but from AOR. So we build it for you and you install them from our repo because hey, the fun and the magic happens in the AUR Arch user repository. That's where stuff uh, any stuff can be found and luckily right we're in luck now this is not so good but okay it's arch keys and key rings the only thing you need to know no 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 control c right pseudo pacman minus s arch linux key ring always start with that first if it is a big download but sometimes everything is just fine and there are days that the key ring has been updated so you need to update and then well first the key ring and then the rest it's just one thing it seems i need to re-download here so voila another video where pseudo pacman minus s arch linux key ring comes before the update if you want to know more you type in arch wiki signing or keys or core keys or something like that and you'll get information on why this is happening 
Every package is signed by a certain person, has a signature, and Pacman checks basically, so it's a safety kind, security. This package is correctly signed. And then we upgrade things. You will see that many of my videos do not update. I do not update with PAMIC. PAMIC is great, we love it. It's from Manjaro. It's it's good, it's super, flat pack, a war, it's all in there, but right, we want to see F12, we want to see what happens to our machines, and application developers tell you sometimes these lines, warning, and then you check it out if it's important or not for you, particularly and so we do as well and if, if we have something to tell you the files have been installed to the scale.config the files have been installed in etc scale so from time to time you go to you go to change uh, you go have a look right what's in etc scale you don't have to do a scale but it really is important to have a look what is this scale all about and since it's a question all the questions oh look at that Arco Linux okay fine typo <laughs> it's okay it's still early all the things you ask frequently is on arclinux.com with a big button burn to USB information about calamaris this is about 50 videos about calamaris all complexity and here's your scale Here's VirtualBox setup. Here is get a bay, switch windows between and Linux. So switch, don't dual boot. And here's the fees, the keys and the fix the keys, all stuff, create your own repository, backups, arch root. Look, you can always fix arch if you know arch root. And it's super simple. We had a great practice September 2022, grub failed us and we had to shroot all of the SSD that I have, which is 30 plus. So fun, right? And yeah, it's now in my fingers. That's for sure. So this is where all the information is. This is your university. And depending on what level of Linux you have, you are already somewhere in the building phase or starting from scratch and so on. It's all here, it's all available. But in this case, we're talking about Qtile. So Arc Linux D, the D for the desktop. Go learn about the desktop go learn about desktops and two new guys Wayland, Hypeland and Sway go learn about desktops All right. in the meantime he's probably up to date voila so a quick sudo reboot sr and now we go over to the theming how do I Eric Dubois how do I start learning about anything new? Here we have already the cursor, that's not okay. We've seen that mm, like two weeks ago or something like that. They were, they is Arch, were so smart to have a package that breaks our theme here. So how do I do this? Control T, now make sure that Arclinux B's are minimal. That I have Sublime Text, it's not in there. That I have Melt. Start with these two, or with any other choice as editor. There, are, There's more, right? Genie and stuff and code, Visual Studio Code, and so on. Super Shift Enter. Then you press Ctrl H, View. Ctrl H, Show Hidden Files. You put the config in here. Go to the .config. And you put Qtile in here, or i3, or Openbox, or BSPWM, right? Choose the one you want to learn about. This is what you need to read, all of it. Super Shift D, Sublime Text. Drag the folder in here. Close Thunar Super Q, and go read everything and anything that's in here. So here's the config.py. The wall is a wallpaper, so nothing to see there but this is where you go and have a look at all the code right so here you have some things that we could change we could change to one two three four five I could change the web edit chat image gimp and so that's one and two and three and four and so on and in your mind open up gimp always on one two three four it's just a thought 
and you can change any of the names of course as long as you've got 10 of them what else we're looking for theming so border the width of the border the color of the border here are some more colors you can change this is all RGB there's nothing special about it so red two uh, figures or two digits three four is green and then RF is blue red green blue some fonts maybe and font size padding you kind of change and here we start already with the widgets list the group box separator current layout separator window name so all of these things refer them to the variable color 5 color 1 all widgets now let's see if we can find something more so here they point to auto start and they say oh what's auto start you go to the qtile scripts auto start qtile scripts auto start and this is okay oh my god belgian but only if the keyboard is belgian then we copy paste the azerty code to there so if you're on qwerty if this result right this this result line 24 is us nothing happens because if us equals be it's not so won't do anything we set some wallpapers here the sexy hotkey demon is here so all the key bindings are in there variety is running and this is you keep on reading these things we have some icons battery icons the archive is old stuff so not needed actually so at some point in time we start deleting deleting it but it's a kind of a backup eh? the system overview that's your conky to get you started with all the key bindings you can read them of course as well here it's a little bit yeah <laughs> full of code it's a conky right so super and then shift and d is the main menu super shift d ah yeah, that's a d menu here are the key bindings for the sexual key demand and here finally we are, are at the themes now what is this this is the colors for the bar and we have the name for it and where do these colors come then well you find this word in the colors Control c you go to the config pi and you do Control find Control v oh yeah so this is the look now so if i change the colors between this guy then it will be crimson is red uh dracula is like purplish i think nord is more bluish and zyna don't recall <laughs> so it's really is all about setting some colors and that's it and all the rest you need to figure out and uh, the, the the border and the color of uh, all these things and the fonts and the size of the fonts it's all somewhere hidden in the code in the python code which is interesting for students who need to learn python why not use qtile then so the the way we've done this is that we say okay you can actually do a simple copy paste right colors for the bar Control c don't delete anything Control c and you go to the init colors and you can say this is replace then Control v right nothing happens you think save super shift r reload and that's all it is it's a color so it's it's now red and little little pinkish if you are not on anything right like so that's it that's it that's just for the colors for the bar and all the rest is up here somewhere now we have also the Control alt e the arch linux 3 tool and what i've just done manually we try to do that with the arch linux 3 tool the only thing is the themer will only respond if qtile is installed sounds obvious right so left wm is not installed you can't click anywhere that's supposed to be that's that's normal right i3 is not installed you can't click anywhere if you are on qtile and it knows that then you can say let's go to north maybe apply theme 
what happens is super shift R he should apply and that's the thing right he should now change the colors and if it doesn't well it's work for me and that's the test also for me to see if this is working I don't think it is so again work <laughs> it's always busy busy I don't like sign I don't know what color this should be in the image but let's apply the theme let's see if something changes it does because it says Arclex sign safe so it's probably a reload how there is indeed a different color so it is working and I must have missed the other one then so Nord best way to see if this ATT is working now I see it is the fact that this is changed <laughs> so we just copy paste some lines over and that is that so ah, yeah. okay so Nord looks like this didn't recall don't know the colors anymore right but it's just that the colors of the bar so there you go all the information is here let me add one more thing and that's this cursor that really bugs me that sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't I see now that the cursor is the way which we want it and that just checking with you guys so remember Arsh put something out and messed up the default folder so the index index team here thanks to the ATT if you launch the ATT it's fixed remember the black cursor in the beginning and scroll back to video in the beginning there was this this strange cursor they say oh, hey that's not normal that's not Argonix look wasn't because of a package of Argonix we did not have an index team anymore it was just gone and I made it a back folder for it and that's it of course the pack safe a pack safe they've made a pack safe for it and we have added again with the ATT added again index team and this is just a backup a fail safe of ATT making sure that the important files have a backup which is exactly the same thing we can show melt so if melt is installed files are identical be part of modern ice that's what we want we don't want the other guy which was Dwight I think uh, so Alex appearance in this particular setup TWM you need to have this guy right the Alex appearance and then you can set the cursors and I do believe it's normally a Dwight and we don't want a Dwight that's it for me so Qtile has been covered theming has been covered and enjoy the look and change a different look so sometimes users give us a new look so Zion is from a user and so create your own view on, on this matter and share it with us and uh, we can add it to the list. Alright, cheers.